Okay, so let's see what today is just. I'm doing this on 11 p.m. today. Okay. I've been I'm already timed out. So let me zoom in a bit. Okay. Okay, I had a call not so long. So I'm gonna share the video. I think this video feels like it's lagging, you know. It's just me. Okay, so let's talk. Um today would have gone without a gist, but I said no, we have to make a gist today. Or more. <laughs> You know those moments when you want to talk for your hand. That's another thing. I don't like this wire. This wire always coming up. Okay, I actually learned how to I think I've learned how to do a better setup. I was supposed to have um uh, okay, that was the day I, I went on a Google Meet. So I spoke for long. Okay. That was when I spoke to Stanley. We spoke for long. Do you know the amount of wisdom we shared on that video? After we we'll talk finish, I checked the, I checked the audio. <laughs> the audio wasn't capturing. So the way this Apple devices works, if you're using a MacBook, and you're trying to screen record, and you're screen recording like a Google Meet, the only thing your screen recorder will capture is your own audio. The other person, the other person's audio doesn't get captured. Except probably you're making the scheme recording and you have a speaker. And then the speaker is loud and you now put the scheme recording. Maybe as you're talking, it's capturing your, your voice as the other person is talking. It's coming out from the speaker and the scheme recording software is capturing it through the mic. You know, that is the only way. But that day, I was using a headphone and I was using my microphone. So I and Stanley, we had spoke for like close to an hour. This guy was giving me so many advices. That was the first day we had a Google Meet. So I loved it very much. I was learning so much. I was like, ah, I'm going to share this people with them. After the whole thing, I went back to my this thing. It wasn't working. I reached out to Stanley. I told him I'm going to make provision so he can get a proper microphone as well, probably a lav mic. So whenever we have another Google Meet, I'll be able to hear him clearly. The following day, nothing one no do. I tried from that day. I kept trying my whole personal best. I wanted to see how I can. Sorry, so I see if this light is blinking. Affecting my eyes. It's affecting my eyes. Let me change it to green. Green. I like using a Mm -hmm. green and um mm -hmm. it's a better this way mm, i think i like it this way i think i like it this way okay so since then i wasn't able to do it and whenever stanley reached out to me he'd be like oh you said they're gonna be on the google mates you know i think he probably even lost hope and he probably felt okay maybe it's don't have head again it wasn't like that though. I was thinking of how I could record his own parts because it's gonna be re echoing. I have loudspeakers. If I put it on a loudspeaker, Stanley's talking, I'm talking, the ambience and this microphone is very sensitive. This is the Shure SM7B. Now this is where my micro my headphone is. I'll say my headphone, my speaker. So this is the speaker I use. Power on. So now this simply means I would have to keep this speaker close just so when he talks, it's a, who is calling me now? She, this guy has been calling my block. Tip. I'm going to block you again. I know your type. You run online and start calling me names. You won't tell them how you were calling me and calling me. Let me send him a voice note before I block him. Hold on. I can't find this. This in here. Hi. He's calling me, he's not even messaging. So he's not even on top of my chat. Block you. Okay. So that was it. I couldn't keep the speaker close. And now the other day, I just told myself that 
it's it's difficult you know putting on or moving on alone i need to start networking with certain kind of people i want to start gisting with people from different walks of life i wanted an okay just to be me bringing up people on board we'll talk you know people from different part of the world we share knowledge you know i get enlightened like i want to host mr stanley tomorrow he told me that he has sent me so many messages on my whatsapp i've not had the time to go through them all of them but i would try and do that ahead of tomorrow so he's going to join us tomorrow so the good news is i downloaded the software so with that software now um it's actually called an extension black hole with that software i can listen to someone like i can record someone directly let me show you i'm gonna switch off this power off it's switched off there is no headphone there's no headphone anymore but i can make calls and i can i can now record calls so i'm gonna start with a client i i was supposed to have a meeting with this person earlier but she did not she did not come online <clears throat> let me share my screen oh please call sir how do i tell you now that the call i was supposed to have with you i've had it with someone else and it's not my fault it did not come online Okay, so this is me here because I'm on the Google Meet. So I'm going to copy, I'm going to copy this link and I'm going to send it to this link. I think she's already stressed out. She's been missing. She's a very patient person. And this guy, you like, you like being blocked though. You know the moment you call me on, she do this block, but you just want to do it. Now you want to pass the points, but you're passing a point in a way that will provoke the person you're pointing a point to. Send me messages. You know, don't don't have to call me on shit, dude. It spoils my um, voice note if I'm on WhatsApp. If I'm making a video, it cuts my video. I think I've explained. You know, the problem is they'll be explaining to people. You add like you don't know. When they block you now, you can't assess me again. Now you start calling me names. I won't answer you because I'm somebody who doesn't even care. Okay, so I've sent the voice note. I've sent the Google Meet to the lady, and I've also sent the voice note to that number that called me initially. You know, that wasn't present. I think she should be joining us anytime soon. On this Google Meet. She did not join us on time. So I had to make that meeting with someone else. Uh, this last video. The last video I uploaded on YouTube. I have this feeling that video is going to gather momentum. Okay, I'm waiting for her online. Uh, when I send people messages like this, you know, complaining, if I'm complaining about something, I like it when you apologize. Don't tell me plenty things. When I tell you I don't like this thing you did, though, it's not the time to start defending yourself. It's time to say, okay, I'm sorry. Even if you're angry about something, you first apologize. And then you not tell me the one because I'm the one now coming up offended. You now say, okay, fine. I'm sorry that I got you upset, but this is this, this is then me. I cannot apologize if I also wronged you. I now look for a solution. Some people, when you caution them, instead of apologizing and you know, let us move over to resolve. You don't want to start talking plenty things. Who answer your archive you? Please read my messages. Okay, good. Making sense. Okay, so I'm going to add her up now to the meeting. Let me get my earphones. Yeah, how you doing? I'm fine, sir. Okay, so firstly, I want to accolade you. Your patient, eh? God, eh? You're married? I'm not. You're a tech person? Yes. Okay. Not really into tech like that. Okay, I just like the fact your patient. Okay, when I called Thank initially... You, um the cons i'm gonna send you i think the video is even available now hold on let me send it to you immediately first of all because i'm on my computer so i sent you that um uh, message you weren't online immediately so i hopped on a call with someone else so basically what what i was trying to do was to set up a live stream to get the adsense account monetize like if you recall 
um you talked about getting a adsense account can you remember you wanted to buy an adsense account yes i did yeah so i advised against it so um today's already gone because this is 11 pm so don't worry about keeping up i'll be able to keep up tomorrow i'll give you a call what we're simply going to do is to set up your like as i'm talking to you is recorded so in case you want to talk okay. turn off your camera or nothing so um tomorrow you're going to create up the channel the channel you told me you would want to create so once you create up the channel we just create bots that will keep streaming the videos i'll show you the easiest way to do it is to go on live stream so when you go on live stream for like a week and those bots are actively streaming your videos it's faster to get monetized so the whole i help, help me mute your uh, mic and thank good. you sir so the whole vps prosy and everything for setting up those things i'll handle it myself so i'm going to give you a call by when do you when do you get back from work let me know what my should do be good sorry i forgot to tell you to turn off your mic turn on your mic rather okay from okay. 6, from 6 p.m yes, okay so let's say you relax up a bit how does 9 p.m work Nine is fine. Okay, I'll give you a call by 9 p.m. tomorrow. So I would walk you through on how to do it yourself. So the whole coding, you don't necessarily need to do the coding yourself. I'll just help you deploy the system. And then I will make a video within the whole process. So if other students comes in, they can just watch how we deploy it to your own, you know, way and learn from there. Thank you, sir. We'll learn in the laptop for it. Mm, you don't need a laptop because I'll be the one doing the major setup. The only thing you will just do is just be on call then uh you're answering this call with the phone yes I am. no you de you definitely need a computer just for the screen so anything i'm doing you'll be able to watch it because on the phone the whole thing is going to be too tiny because i'll be sharing my screen on most things i'll do i ask because i'm currently not with my laptop okay okay when would you be getting it mm, the person that took it will be back next week okay really you don't really need to use a laptop for anything apart from watching me do it so except when i'm done with it like i just sent you a video now of the one the call i had with someone so except maybe when i'm done maybe whenever you get your laptop you can just go back to watch the videos would that sound better yes it's fine okay now see you tomorrow by 9 pm thank you sir no? thank you yeah okay so now you see how beautiful it is now to make this call this was the kind of quiet wish i had with mr stanley so i think i'm going to be online often nowadays because i would want to consistently put my head towards work i would want to talk to lots of people i feel the kind of work i do i don't have anybody who encourages me i don't have anybody who gives me strength if i'm feeling bad right now now yo i have to I have to I have to make myself happy. No, but there's nobody that I have that tells me don't worry, that gives me hope. So what I'm planning on doing is to be online often and try to talk to lots of people, help them get something done, you know, so it becomes a community where I have people as well who'll be growing along. And even if something is bothering me, I feel if I talk to people and I hear their own story. This is sometimes they be like say, Oh, what's past? You don't hear, you don't hear that person's story. Don't be so with the do the team where people story they laugh they happy but you know you get to feel okay fine if you're in this point what what's your move right now okay you know you you to also make me remember okay that was maybe once upon a time I was at this point and this is where I am now I'll be able to give that person strength and why doing that I'll also be able to have strength so that that should be the concept of the whole gist so um the call with mr stanley i think i would prefer doing it in the afternoon tomorrow so i can have time for my students towards evening okay so this is the gist for today did i tell you any major thing no am i smiling yes am i moody no the danokegroup.com is done the head of software i think he tried he said he deployed it i still have my own oh i still need to go check out some things on it and see how it works and give him my own verdict but today has been a very busy day if i'm going to be honest with you i've been upset and i've been trying not to be upset 
it feels bad that i'm feeling bad nowadays because early this year i used to be very happy and i was working and i was so interested in you know the big vision the big future i don't know how come i'm i'm unhappy nowadays things are just getting me upset right and even when i'm upset there's nobody to talk to like i don't have a friend i don't have anybody who will say oh this guy is upset how do we make him happy so i'm just going to cut this video and i'll go and smoke a blunt and try to see how i can imagine beautiful things then tomorrow by the time we'll have a call with stanley and our students and help them be able to set up something i think i'll have bigger purpose and i think this way if i'm constantly trying to put smile on people's face every day i think maybe to make me more happy i don't really know why i'm actually feeling bad i really feel bad about so many things but i just know that i'll be fine so see you all today is the gist for the 25th of april 2023